Question 161. Read the following statements and choose the correct option. Statement A reads, In dorsoventrally flattened worms, removal of nitrogenous waste occurs through flame cells. Statement B. Some members of platyhelminthes such as planaria possess high regeneration capacity and live with an alimentary canal of man. Yes, it's true that in platyhelminthes, that is your flat worms, the nitrogenous waste is removed using a specialized cell named as flamed cell. So statement A is correct. Statement B reads that these members, one of being planaria, it possesses high regeneration capacity, which is true, and live within alimentary canal of man. This is incorrect. Planaria is a free living organism. It is found in freshwater streams and rivers and it is not an endoparasite to live in alimentary canal of man so the second half of statement b is incorrect which makes it incorrect so my options that both statements are incorrect is wrong both statements are correct is also wrong only statement a is incorrect but b is correct is wrong and option four that statement a is correct which is true and b is incorrect and this is also true so my answer is option 4. Question 162. The correct set of animals belonging to class Chondrichthys is and sets of 3, 3 organisms are given in option 1, 2, 3 and 4. We have to choose the option in which animals belonging to only class Chondrichthys is present. Let's go over the options one by one. In option 1, Scoliodon, it's a Chondrichthys. I'm going to label it by code words as C and Ostichthys as O. Pristis is also a chondrichthys and trigon is also a chondrichthys. So all of these, scoliodon, pristis and trigon all are chondrichthys which makes it my correct answer because it is the correct set. Let's look at other options. Exocetus, that is my flying fish, is an ostichthys. Torpedo is chondrichthys and pristis is also chondrichthys. So this is not the correct set because one of the organisms belongs to ostichthys. Option 3, Scoliodon is a Chondrichthys, Katla is an Ostichthys and Hippocampus is also an Ostichthys. So this is again an incorrect set. Option 4, Pristis and Carcharodon both are Chondrichthys whereas Beta also known as the Fighting Fish is Ostichthys. This is again an incorrect set. The right answer is option number 1, the correct set of only Chondrichthys. Question 163. Choose the option which includes all flightless birds. The scientific names of several birds are given in combinations of three. Let's have their common names. Neophron is vulture in option one. Pavo is peacock and Corvus is crow. Option number two. Struthio is ostrich. Aptenodites is your penguin and Apteris is kiwi. Option number three, Cytacula is parrot. Vulture is given as it is and struthio that is ostrich. Option number four, pavo is peacock. Apteris is kiwi and columba is pigeon. Among these, the right set of flightless birds means they cannot fly is option number two because ostrich, penguin and kiwi cannot fly high or are not very well equipped with flying. Whereas in the remaining options, ostrich and kiwi is present but it's not the right set of only or all flightless birds. That's why these are incorrect. The right answer is option number two. Question 164. Select the incorrect statement. Aves are homeothermous animals. Yes, that is right. The birds have a regulatory mechanism in the body which maintains their body temperature. Thus, they are homeothermous. So, this is a correct statement. Option 2. Development is direct in reptiles. This is also true. They do not go any intermediate stage or a larval stage. The development is indeed direct in reptiles. So this is also correct. Option 3. Ichthyopis is a limbless amphibian. That is right. Ichthyopis does not have any limbs on its body. 
and lastly option 4 air sacs and lungs in birds are vascular the respiratory system is highly developed in birds and consists of lungs and air sacs the lungs are vascular whereas air sacs are non vascular and they only supplement the respiration they provide the extra air which a bird needs to efficiently fly high and do not run short of air so these are supplementary and are avascular these air sacs thus the statement states that both are vascular is incorrect so the right answer is option number 4 thus the air sacs are non vascular they do not have any blood supply in them they only provide for the extra amount of air needed during flight correct answer is option number 4 question 165 which one of the following pairs is mismatched with respect to organisms and one of their features option number 1 torpedo is matched with electric organs that is right it's an chondrichthys and it kills its prey and possesses electric organs which is used to deliver an electric shock to kill its prey or enemies so this is correct option 2 sawfish matched with cycloid scales the sawfish is also called as prestis and its jaw looks like a saw because it bears its teeth on its edges and prestis uses this saw to kill its prey the skin of sawfish is tough and contains minute placoid scales and not tenoid or cycloid scales this is the second matching sawfish with cycloid is incorrect it should have been placoid scales option 3 naja which is a reptile possess epidermal scale yes they do possess epidermal scales which gives their skin a dry and cornified appearance option 4 canis with mammary glands yes canis is scientific name for dog it possesses mammary glands because it belongs to class mammalia so this is a correct match the only incorrect match is option number 2 here that becomes our answer answer is 